Hey everybody, Justin Cener here. How's it going? I got a great video today and I want to talk all about the benefits of using Shopify and the really awesome ecosystem of apps and plugins and uh, all the incredible things you could add on to your store. And I'm going to talk about something that a lot of people don't often talk about and that's kind of making sure that all of your apps and your code and your theme uh, play nice together, right? It's something that we typically don't have to be concerned with because we don't have to deal with code. And that's one of the best parts of Shopify. Obviously, you see over here, you can start selling with Shopify today, free trial, all that great stuff. But the really thing that we always overlook is the fact that as soon as we sign up for that free trial, we get a fully functional e-commerce site built, right? Shopping cart, uh, theming system, account management system, obviously the back end, all the integrations, all these things happen out of the box. And you know, uh, let's say five, 10 years ago, you would have had to spend tens of thousands of dollars to build your own custom e-commerce platform with Shopify. All you need to do is enter in your email address. So literally you get to save so much money. I mean, the alternative would be to go something, go to somewhere like Upwork. You see over here, I just came to Upwork. It's a place where there are a lot of freelancers. You type in e-commerce, you see $100 an hour, $110 an hour, $100 an hour, 50, 35, 97, 50, right? Huge prices here per hour. With Shopify, you get your platform, you get your whole store up and running, you get all these different free themes to choose from, and all you need to do is enter your email address. You get this 14-day free trial if you check out this link, shopify.com slash cener, C-E-N-E-R. But the point here is that, you know, without needing any code, without needing to look at any code, without needing to hire a developer, without needing to go to a, a freelance site, without needing to learn HTML or JavaScript or anything like that, you could have your fully functional e-commerce site up and running. That's why Shopify, by far the, the best platform to work with. And let me just illustrate real quick. I'll just bring over a, a, a sample Shopify store, right? Here's just a little uh, a sample dog lover store, right? Let's say you wanted to uh, change the colors around, right? You wanted to change all the colors. Typically, you'd have to hire a coder to change the CSS. It's basically just the, the, the style sheet for your site. If you don't know what that is, that's totally fine because with Shopify, you don't have to deal with code, right? With Shopify, you could just literally click around and we say we want to change the header color. We simply just go to the header section and we could change it to any color we want, right? If we wanted to uh, make it yellow, or uh, if we wanted to make it orange, right? Any color we want, it will just automatically upload, right, to whatever we want, right? And we could set any color that we want there. I'm just gonna refresh it back because we're gonna go back to our normal brown. But the point is that if we wanted to make a change that typically requires code, we don't need to do that with Shopify, and that's one of the biggest reasons why Shopify is such an awesome platform. Now, here's something that a lot of people don't talk about. When you install all these different apps and themes, and you go back and forth switching between themes and turning on apps and turning off apps and adding in features, maybe even copy and pasting some scripts that you might have found on Facebook groups or something like that. You start to introduce all these different types of codes, uh, different code languages, different uh, scripts, different JavaScripts, different JavaScript libraries, all these different things that typically with Shopify you don't have to be concerned with. But there is an opportunity for you to really introduce code that can break your theme, slow down your site, basically just make changes to your uh, overall uh, uh, store without you kind of understanding what's going on in the background because we don't need to do any of that. That's the whole point of apps, but there are risks to that at some point. And you know, coming from a web development background myself, I know of the importance of backing up things. And you could definitely download your theme file. You could be able to basically export your theme code, but that's not a true backup. Like uh, let's say back in, in uh, the WordPress days, you could be able to back up your entire database. Right. And what I'm going to show you is basically a solution, Shopify's own solution or a Shopify specific solution for creating these backups. Okay. And it's a super powerful tool that's going to basically allow you to make changes to your site, install apps, and never have to worry about kind of code conflicts or really messing anything up. So this is Theme Watch, and they call it the Theme Backup Tool. Basically, what it's going to do is create automatic entire Shopify store backups for you and have give, uh, give you the ability to then restore those backups or recover those backups at any time. Let's say you want to just test something out, you can go back. Let's say something breaks, you can go back. And these can happen automatically. And they also do a couple other really cool things that I want to show you now. And uh, this app, you can see the link below this video to go ahead and grab this app. It's free to install. And I'll talk about how uh, the pricing works in a second. But this watch feature, this is basically going to you know, be uh, uh, act as your eyes when it comes to any changes on your theme, right? Let's say your theme, and this happens with Shopify official themes and third-party themes. Let's say something gets updated. Uh, you know, let's say a new feature comes out. Let's say a, a brand new Shopify feature comes out and it needs to be integrated into the theme, right? These things happen and Shopify updates their themes all the time, right? What Theme Watcher is gonna do for you 
just in terms of this, I'm sorry, what Theme Watch is going to do for you is it's going to keep an eye out on those changes. So it's going to basically track when changes come out. Right? It's going to be able to track that and then it's going to be able to make different backup points for basically before the changes and after the changes. So you're going to be free to always have the, the most up-to-date version of your theme, but if you don't want it, you can go back. Right? And backup, the next feature, that's obviously the core of Theme Watch. Right? It's going to basically create a backup automatically every single day of your entire Shopify store, your theme included. Okay? Then the restore feature, obviously taking those backups, being able to go and implement those backups, restoring those backups. Okay, it's literally saying I, I'm going to go back in time. Okay, uh, let's say I installed this app and I don't really like how it worked and I removed it, but it left some code in here and I don't know exactly what to do. Just basically restore back to yesterday's code. It's not you don't lose any orders, you don't lose products. It's just basically a screenshot uh, uh, of your entire theme setup, and it's just going to go back to that. All right, so it's kind of the three main features of Theme Watch, and there's really nothing else out there like that. It's really creating an entire backup of your store, it doesn't matter what you do. Let's say you're experimenting with some scripts, you wanna add checkout scripts or you wanna uh, maybe add some trust badges and let's say you, you're going to edit the code yourself and you mess up. Well, no problem, you literally just back up to before when you made the change, you just restore to that backup and you're good to go, right? As uh, you know, in, in the kind of web development space and any kind of development space, the idea is that you're always trying to make backups of where you're at so there's never kind of a, a catastrophic event where you you know, uh, uh, knock on wood, hopefully this never happens, but, you know, do something to, to knock the site off or to break a specific feature. This kind of, uh, uh, you know, automatically eliminates that. And like I said, it's uh, really the only tool that I found that can do this successfully. And, uh, you know, you can read more about this. Really, obviously, you can do manual backups as well, but the real big thing is all about the automatic daily backups. Um, you're going to really be able to just, you know, have uh, eventually a huge calendar of being able to go back to different versions of your site. And uh, I'll give you a little pro tip on this. You know, a really, really great thing to do with this, although this isn't backing up in terms of um, needing to back up for security reasons or safety, but how about for holidays, right? I, have, I can back up to my Christmas theme. I can back up to my 4th of July theme. I can back up to my Halloween theme of my site where I have a little bit different logo, a little bit different color scheme because I have those backed up. And, you know, I can literally just go back in time and look at the... Uh, you know, the daily back, uh, uh, backup for, let's say, uh, December 1st, that I can go ahead and implement my color scheme and my Christmas design and my Christmas logo basically within one click. So that's like a nice, you know, you'll learn different ways to use this app. Obviously, the basic way is for the backups, but that's a really powerful way that I can use it as well. Keep an eye on the theme changes. Like I said, you know, they're always adding things. They're always changing things. This is going to really allow you to always kind of understand. You get a 30-day uh, free trial when you go through my link. And basically the way that pricing works is it's $3 a month per theme. Okay, if you want to back up multiple themes, which, you know, uh, in, in my opinion, you're typically not going to be doing that, um, at least on an individual store, that's going to give you the daily and, you know, mo uh, manual backups. You can back up anytime manually, and you're also going to be on those automated daily backups. So like $3 a month. All right, I mean, it's, it's literally, it's a no-brainer here to install this. If, you know, not going with this never happens, but if it does, something happens to your site, you install an app, you try some code change, something happens where, uh, you know, things break down. For $3 a month, $3 a month, you just click the backup and restore button and you can go back to it. Right, I mean, it's a no-brainer to install this. It's really nothing else that does. This is a pretty new app out here, but it's already got all five-star reviews. So definitely check this out. Again, you get a 30-day free trial when you use my link. Uh, you see the link below this video right now. So highly recommend ThemeWatch. I want you to go ahead and check it out. Uh, it's in the Shopify app store and the link is below this video right now. It's only $3 a month. I mean, you know, just make sure you have that peace of mind to be able to back up and restore your site to literally any day from uh, the moment that you install this tool on. So really powerful. Check it out. Hope this video helps you make some money and uh, really more importantly, save some headaches. And I'll talk to you real soon.